hello my wonderful people welcome back to my kitchen today i'm preparing this chicken and mushroom curry sauce yes you heard me right chicken and mushroom curry sauce so if you like it join me as we do this together on my table i have my mushroom my shredded chicken breast the chicken breast is better because it is soft and doesn't really have much uh, bone i have my ginger and garlic paste my bouillon cube you can see different colors of bell peppers the green red and yellow we are using that then i want my sauce to be a bit hot i don't want it to be somehow in my mouth i want it a bit hotter as well you see i have some peppers there i have my seasonings i have my thyme curry onion powder paprika chicken seasoning and then black pepper to season the chicken of course the salt and then vegetable oil then here i have what we take this our sauce to another level i have my sesame oil here oyster sauce chili and soy sauce the light one then the thickener or the slurry we have the cornstarch so guys let's just do this together so guys before we start i have to marinate the chicken I have thyme, onion powder, curry powder, paprika, uh, chicken seasoning, and then black pepper. I'll just add everything in here. Then add some salt. Then I will now combine everything together and leave to marinate for some time. So this is what I'm doing now. You can marinate and keep in the fridge overnight. But uh, I don't have that time. So I'll just marinate a light to stay for like so 10 minutes while I prepare the other things like cutting the uh, peppers. So this is um, this is okay now. I'll just allow it to rest. Then I'll cut the pepper is now because i want to prep everything so when i start i start so let me slice the peppers now take out the seed you can cut in any shape you want to but I'll just cut mine like this. Cut it a bit thinly. So I'm done with the peppers, you can see. So just slice the mushrooms a bit, not too tiny, but just this shape. So you can have the feeling when you are um, taking your sauce. And this sauce can go with rice or any pasta of your choice or anything you feel like taking it with. So I'm now chopping the peppers, there is the scotch bonnet pepper, so that my sauce will be a bit hot. I'm done now, so we can start cooking. You know, I told you that, uh, I always tell you that when you prep your stuff, when you want to cook, it doesn't take you more than uh, 10 minutes to do whatever you want to do. It depends on what you are cooking anyway. But with this one, in the next 10 minutes, we are out of this place. My people, so we are ready to cook now. The heat is on. I'll just turn in some vegetable oil in the pan to be a bit hot. The oil is hot now, so I'll add in the chicken.
you have to keep stirring it so it doesn't um, burn and so that all the sides of the chicken will be well cooked You can see what we have here. It's okay now, so I'll take them out. Let's add some more oil to the one I did in frying. I'll add the onions, chopped onions. Now add the ginger and garlic paste. I'll add the scotch bonnet pepper. Adding the red bell pepper, green and the yellow bell pepper. Then I'll add the mushrooms. I'll now introduce the chicken. Allow to simmer for like three minutes. I'll add in some water and I'll cover for it to cook for five minutes. So let me make our slurry or tikna. So this um, the sesame oil, the oyster, the soy sauce, and chili. I'll just add them inside the cornstarch before I pour it into the pot. This is sesame oil. This oyster sauce. This is the game changer of this our mushroom chicken curry sauce wow what happened to this bottle then i have chili here so i'm adding some water i'll stir to remove any lump
so this is ready now then we'll continue yeah so what we have so i'll be adding my bouillon cube curry and chicken powder remember is curry sauce stir very well then i'll add the slurry or thickener the thickener the um, oyster sauce soy sauce uh, sesame oil they are all in there you can see it's thickening now so depends on how you want yours you dilute wow the aroma in my kitchen is nose blocking guys please if you have not subscribed yet to my channel and you are passing by for the first time please do if you have thank you very much keep liking keep sharing so I'll add some salt now then I'll turn off the heat this will go with rice boiled potato anything you feel like taking it with let me just test for salt now mmm yummy yummy our chicken mushroom curry sauce is ready i'll see you guys